Welcome to Marrakesh, 47. The situation grows more tense by the minute. The consulate is under lockdown, but the protests are only a stone throw away from full-blown riots, and Zaydan won't hesitate to unleash his troops. So whatever you're planning, time is of the essence. Good luck, 47. Mister? How's your father? Doing well. Thanks for asking. He's upstairs right now working on the to locate General Zaydan. General Satan's order. Uh, yes, sir. Uh, thank you, sir. You're dismissed. General Satan's order. Uh, yes, sir. Uh, thank you, sir. That is General Reza Zaydan, Keeper of the Peace. Time to decide. What should I do? Well, don't tell me you're sleeping, Said. Right? 
Target down. Move on to Klaus Strandberg. You made it. Most impressive, 47. Now to locate Klaus Stram. Yeah, yeah, sure. Officer? Of course. I just, I just don't see the need for all the secrecy. And you don't have to. Orders are orders. Look, trust me, you don't want us in the building. We don't exactly inspire a sense of tranquility. And I can't have your men slouching around downstairs. So you just hold the fort, up here, and my guys will take care of the rest, yeah? Yeah, yeah, right. Take care of the rest. Slouching. My guys don't slouch. Maybe someday you'll be a real bodyguard.
Pam Kingsley and her people should have a right. Both targets down. Now head towards an exit. Massage expert Connie Angstrom report at the reception desk. That was Connie Angstrom. Please go to the reception desk. But I... I don't understand. There is no sign of forced entry, no alarms, nothing. One of my people has gone missing in Johannesburg. A key bearer. I wish I'd been informed. Still, the system demands two keys, and the rest are all accounted for. Except for your late predecessors. Comp? But... His plane went down over the Pacific. It was an accident. Such was the conclusion at the time. Yes. Seems like a conspiracy. Probably isn't. And yet, the failed coup in Morocco, the ether virus. Someone knows about us. There was a pattern and I failed to see it. Providence is under attack. <clears throat> How much was that? Money? <laughs> Not money, Mr. Fennin. Information on all of our assets and operatives. Like you. Dig a trench, Director. And make it a deep one. Because none of you are safe anymore. <laughs> <laughs> 